If and when the Tigers emerge from the rebuild and begin to contend again, there won't be many pieces left from this roster we're going to be watching. I will bet you, though, Jamer Candelario will be there. Since he arrived in the Alex Avila Justin Wilson trade last year from the Cubs, all he's done is hit, solidified a job at third, and proven himself to be a building block for the long haul. Justin Rose has more on the Tigers' third baseman. Brad, when the Tigers traded away all the memorable names from the roster over the past couple of seasons, fans are starting to scratch their head and wonder, who's the next guy to cheer for? Jammer Candelario carrying the flag early on for this young core of new Tigers. I feel comfortable. I feel like it was a big opportunity for me, and, and thanks God that I, I take advantage, and, and we're here um, doing the best that we can to, to help the team. His 357 batting average over the last 15 games has been a major bright spot for the Tigers thus far. And for Candelario to be in the shadow of Miguel Cabrera and Victor Martinez, well, that's speeding up his learning curve. He works very, very hard at his craft, um, you know, doing his defensive work and, and his offensive work. Uh, um, I think that's that's kind of the part that I enjoy the most is there's a young man that has a real plan. Talk about high praise, Ron Gardenhire even compared him to a little bit of Joe Maurer in the batter's box. That hot hitting can continue. The Tigers will start to get closer and closer to that 500 mark. With the Tigers downtown Detroit, Justin Rose, 7 Action Sports.